quickly as possible to what does flare up, it's a very tough ask. And that the Met know, they've got their GT control in Lambeth, that gold control manned by senior commanders this evening. In fact, it's been running 24 hours since the early hours of Sunday morning. Uh, and those officers now are there uh, trying to keep on top of that situation, monitoring CCTV, monitoring what's happening from the police helicopter. And of course, as they do monitoring uh, the pictures from ourselves, our colleagues at the BBC, uh, and just trying to get an idea of where the trouble in Hackney is at the moment and whether it has a likelihood to spread. And at the same time, of course, Jeremy, trying to keep an eye on all of these other London boroughs. A very tough ask. And the other thing that uh, I think has become more and more apparent is just uh, how quickly these uh, elements of what appear to be quite young people, teens, early 20s, mainly uh, male youths, how quickly they move and respond and organise. And uh, you've got a theory about just how they're communicating there, Mark. Yeah, I think to some extent there is some orchestration here. Certainly the, uh, the police believe that that has happened. Uh, there has been some evidence on it. Colleagues of ours uh, from other news outlets, uh, Paul Lewis, uh, the Guardian, has been doing some sterling work. He has been trying to get on top of what's happening with, the, for instance, the Blackberry Messenger which is difficult to really get a handle on because it's a bit of a closed system. You have to be, you know, someone who uh, is known to whoever is messaging you. You're uh, part of a select group that's messaged. But he's managed to uh, get some evidence which suggests certainly, as far as yesterday was concerned, uh, that the uh, disturbances in Enfield uh, were coordinated, uh, were organised to some extent through the BlackBerry messaging system in one particular uh, uh, Blackberry message that it says uh, everyone in Edmonton, Enfield, Wood Green, everywhere in the north link up at Enfield Town Station at four o'clock sharp. Now that message was posted on the Blackberry message system uh, throughout uh, the afternoon yesterday and of course we know then what happened around about that time in Enfield there were disturbances which became at times really quite serious in terms of the looting that happened in that area. Now in addition to this there have been uh, quite a few uh, Blackberry messages going out today with a similar vein uh, naming several London boroughs and ta uh, targets uh, which of course we won't name um, uh, but again mustering, trying to muster uh, people, like-minded people, to go to cause trouble uh, in these areas. Uh, so it remains to be seen if that does happen, certainly at this very early stage uh, in the afternoon, in the early evening, uh, trouble erupting in Hackney, Jeremy. So a worrying sign for the evening ahead. And I don't want to sound flippant, but you know, you couldn't really have a better day for a bit of civil dis uh, disobedience and, and uh, disturbances. It's not raining, it's pretty warm and humid out here and no sign of any rain yet, which is a policeman's best friend when it comes to trying to deter a lot of these people.